What's up, everybody? The con man here. Well, yesterday I went fishing. I'm sorry I forgot it, but we're gonna go fishing back today, and it's gonna get early, get dark early, so it's gonna get dark like at five. So we're gonna go around three ish. It's because of daylight savings time, of course. But yesterday I caught a six pound and 30 ounce craft fish. I'll show you it right now. And I cut it off of this bait caster, this Abby Garcia Max B Max 3 rod and reel. And it works pretty well. And I was using a warm hook right here. I can't tell you what size that is. Sorry. And they're using this half ounce weight. And I caught that big boy off of that one. And I'm going to use that today. And we use sausages for bait. And then. This Matt Zoo, I wish I could tell you what type of wheel it is, but everything is kind of erased on there. So yeah, that kind of sucks. And yesterday, when I was fishing with this, I'm pretty sure this is, mm, I don't know what type of line this is. It feels like string. But anyways, I cast it out there. This pole almost went flying in the water. I picked it up. I went to go set the hook, and the fish just like took like the hook and like almost like three to four inches of line so it was crazy this is four i believe i'm not sure but yeah those are the two fishing poles that i used yesterday and this is a circle hook and it's red and i think they make it red because it looks like the fish is bleeding or the bait's bleeding in the same type of weight so yeah guys we're gonna go fishing around then and if anything pops it up, I'll do a little vlog. See you then. I don't know. If I'm using, I don't think I'm using any more poles, but if I do, I'll tell you. See ya, whenever. On this pole, ten pound line. This pole, fourteen pound line. So yeah, that fish broke off a fourteen pound line. So I'm wondering if that was a huge fish. We'll go and fish, and so here's a little time lapse before we get there. Finally. We got a fish. There he is. First catfish. A little tangled in the line. <laughs> cool. I got one too. Yeah, I didn't even know. <laughs> oh, look at this one. A little bit smaller. I was like, what's going on here? And he swallowed the hook. Of course. Let's try it. I was wondering what the heck was going on. Oh. Uh, how deep is it? He won't open his mouth, of course, you won't. Yeah, I'm gonna cut the line. You wanna hold him? No. She said that might hurt him. No, I'm not, I'm not going to cut him. I'm just going to cut the line. There he is. I see his eyes. Yep. Yeah. Hello, Mom's got a little... Put it over here. Yeah. A little sunfish. Nice. Good job. I got something on this one. No, never mind. I got garbage. It's no. I think it's your g-string, Paul. That is so disgusting. Paul, why'd you leave this in here? Oh. Ooh, I gotta check. 
Well, guys, that was just a little fishing section, session, section, session that I did with my family. And if you ever go fishing with your family, always do it because those could be the greatest memories. And sometimes you don't get to see your family out, or sometimes you get to hang out with your family a lot. But when you're in nature, just fishing, hanging out with them is always a good thing. So thank you everybody for watching, for watching, like, comment, subscribe, and as always, stay classy.